I think I should get it one, but leather is good. Leather is warm, leather is cool. Where is the leather one? It's a brown one. There it is. Oh, this does look cool. I like it. Okay, actually, you know what? Yeah. They will know who I am. Do I have like a bit? No, wait. Where's my wolf mask? Which one is in that? The legendary one. I mean, if I'm on the quest, I need to be dressed as a, a wizard. I mean, like not as a as a student. Which one do they want? The dark? No. Emerald Highland Rustic. Wait, did I? Relaxed. Teal striped. Hmm. What are the extra ones? This Grey Voyager. Something cool from the uh, a troll hat. That's a weird one. Lucky leprechaun. A bowler hat. Fedoras. Stylish top hat. Classic sorcerer. What is the it has a leather sorcerer head? This is actually fit color recycling. Byzantine beret. Hmm. I'm exchange if I could. Yeah. No hats then. But I can put on a legendary Dark Arts Dragon Hide Herbologist Lucky Leprechaun Hogwarts Regalia Only Black and Brown Refined You all look at this sleep. Dark arts. Stinger. Outland. No. Of course. There we go. I'm the masked wizard. Oh, yeah. A scarf? Sure, why not? What's it's cold in here? So I'm actually going to be walking about something else than a school uniform. Rebellion. <coughs> Repair. Ha! The goblins can't know it was me. Rebellion. This is the collection you need to... What is that? Cast Stupefy on an enemy. Sebastian, do you mind? I'm, try I'm, I'm, trying, I'm trying to do something here. Hang about.
Thank you. I missed. Oh, another one. Ignite shooter as it prepares an attack. Anything else? No? Hmm. Fwish swoosh. Revelio. Well, this doesn't work. Revelio. Again. Dead goblin. So maybe there were none dead goblins in the area before because they cleaned out the bodies. Hmm. Well, we're making quick work of them. Professor Hecate would be proud. Indeed. She would at that. Ramrock's loyalists have all but declared war. Rebellion. Oh, but. Wait, no. This is where I need to go. Devil's snare. I can hear goblins. Lumos. Lumos. That's a lot of spiders. A grub horn statue. Move aside. Lumos. What did I find in there? I didn't notice. Rebellion. Oh, hello. There's a chest in here. Hmm. Lumos. What is it called? Stereo? Indigo Sorcerer Rebellion. Hat. Spider. Oh, hello. I blew him up. Rebellion. Was it Sebastian? It doesn't matter who did this. It was a group effort, a team effort, dual effort. Still not seen a single rune symbol. Hmm. I think we're going to be a bit distracted from runes for a moment. An unwelcome distraction at that. Well, who would have thought? The distraction of what? Of sorts, exactly. We have another fight on our hands. Why am I not surprised? Hmm. Shall we then? Catch. Very spider nature. What? There are no spider matrix here. Complete the battle for using okay. Whoops. Burn. Kind of hilarious, actually. Oh, 
stop that. Dang it. Why am I... Ugh. Fudge it. Ah! Spiders? Where did they come from? No. Oh, now they're fighting each other. Fine, I'm gonna step to the sidelines. Good job. Oh. Come over here. This works. Where did you come from? Where did you come from? Wait for the Ackerman Church pull up for some reason. Burn. Anyone else? Forty. We certainly cleared the room. You're not a yeah. bad chap for a Slytherin. <laughs> There's that Hufflepuff loyalty you're so well known for. Cool. We're getting along. We're getting along. Calling each other houses again. Hufflepuff loyalty. Rebellion. Not a bad chap for a Slytherin. Excuse me, where did that come from? We've been all buddy buddy until this point. <sighs> We can have a look around in peace. Yes, because they're all in pieces. Moonstone. What? That was not a moonstone, I'm confused. Rebellion. Anything else in here? Hold on. Okay, I see ancient magic symbols. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. Indeed, wait. It's underground again. How does this happen? I'm gonna need this later. Or maybe not. Hold on. 
Wasn't that opens that. it. Why wouldn't you? Akio, come to me. Akio, Wingardium Leviosa. This works. Goblins are quite dumb that you don't see a giant rune. Revelio. Sorry. Hey, there's a bag in here, and I missed it. One fair. A silver scarf. Oh, now those are stairs. Nice place. Oh, this is a thing. Revelio. Sebastian, I think I found something. A canvas piece. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still, something about this place feels odd. Yes. I mean, I don't sense any ancient magic in here, but... Who was studying here? I'm seeing skulls. Is a Dora's journal entry 3 of 7. The world floated back to me as if in a watery haze. How long had I been unconscious? I only remember his eyes. Empty. Empty of sorrow. Yes, but also... I recall feeling a sense of euphoria as I watched the pain vanish, but then everything started to turn. When I fell, I must have hit my head. I neither feel nor see a mark, but the pain is throbbing. I can only hope it is not the Black Death. At least he is no longer in pain. What do you have? Revelio. A journal entry by Isadora. Hopefully it will help us unravel more of this mystery. Hmm. Sebastian, where are you? I gotta talk to you. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft, and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft, why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols? And ancient magic that no one but you could see? Isadora and Percival Rackham, another of the Keepers, could see traces of ancient magic too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. Here's are some of the memories I've seen. I don't think he and Isadora saw eye to eye on how this magic should be used. Indeed. It's all rather baffling. Let's take the canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers are there. I mean, I kind of see the uh, resemblance between odd. me and Sebastian. Oh, I'm fascinated by it. Of course now, you are. For the trek back out of here and to Hogwarts. Unless we can find another passageway to the Undercroft. Let's have a look around. Every place is connected to the Undercroft. Rebellion. You think it was like the Undercroft is kind of like the uh, Chamber of Secrets? Like this Isadora Morgan is like a special place where she could have worked in secret as Slytherin did. There it is. I wonder how long this room has been wiping this floor. Because if this is like Isadora's hidden chamber, it has to be like going for like a century? More than a century? Regardless. But yeah, I don't need to be in my magical Avenger at this point. That's what I'm calling it, a magical Avenger. My glasses, my glasses, I can't be seen without my glasses. Like Doctor Strange over here, kind of. Which one was it? This one. So the main problem is like with the hair. The scarf and hair like this. Hair should be above the scarf. The model should. No, no, but yeah. And that's why I usually don't like. 
to have this on me. Kind of bold assumption this leads to the undercroft. Yes, I should be able to see the undercroft from there, but yeah. Kind of weird for me that when he was saying about the trip to go for the, about that weird holocron thingy looking magic. And now for the moments of truth, it has to fit. Uh, hope, hopefully. So which part, the main one or the side one? Please tell me you recognize the location in this bit of canvas. The good news is I do, in fact. I knew a hanging around for a reason. We're in for more trouble. Oh no kidding. What sort of trouble? I know that coast. Ranrock has taken over a huge mine in the surrounding area. Mara and Weem has suffered for it. It's as bad as Feldcroft's become. Should we head there now? We should wait. Why? All this time we've been a step behind Ranrock. I may know someone who could help us get ahead. Who is that? A friendly goblin. He wants no part in Ranrock's fight. A friendly goblin? A friendly goblin. No. Goblins cursed my sister to shut her up. Said she should be seen and not heard. I do, but not all goblins are... Not all goblins what? Have you forgotten, Feldcroft? Have you forgotten the mine we just went through? No, Sebastian, I haven't. You're not listening to me. Listen Why to me. Listen to someone so ignorant? Who's ignorant? You call me... Oi. Well, that was cruel. Perhaps your uncle was right about you. You don't know when to stop. Oh, I do know when to stop. That's not what I want to say. Unbelievable. I told you the truth for your friends. Bloody Slytherin. Sebastian, wait, hold on. I don't want to leave you as yet. I wondered if you might teach me how to cast that curse you mentioned. Uh, that. Oh. Which one? We just had a fight and we just all buddy buddy. Teach me a curse, would you? No. On second thought, perhaps I don't need to learn any curses at the moment. Very well. Let's speak again soon. Oh, cool. So I we, have we... thrilling news. I believe my next broom upgrade to be even more impressive than the last. Come by Spin Witches as soon as you can. Can you upgrade my flying uh, creatures? No. They, uh, wait. Well, how would? You... Never mind. I can go to spin witches. This thing can absolutely go to quests. Find the location of the third keeper trial. The sky is the limit. Locate on the map. You know what? Hold on, because before that, I am going to identify some of the items. that I have on me. Secret rooms. Like absolutely one of those rooms should be the... Uh, I just forgot. The Undercroft. Which is coincidental, it can be... Uh, Surname when a certain Mr. Underfield marries, marries a certain Miss, Mrs. Croft. Regardless, I absolutely misunderstood what the plants mean. I thought they, I can pick from it five times, but no, it regenerates itself once every ten minutes. And it deals me a set of items okay and now I can actually pick them up more mallow sweet five fifteen in total and some note grass I put a small well a big herb table in here that's not the main reason I came here. Where is...
blue leather gloves, distinguished school robe, refined dueling gloves, gold dragon eye spectacles, leather sorcerer hat, rug dueling gloves, and tartan sunrise scarf. Hmm. View upgrade. I can actually upgrade it even more. Destruction 1. Increases damage of Confringo. Jobernal Feather. Offense 6. But the defense. I'm, I'm waiting for the. I'm gonna be upgrading like the maximum level items that I can get, which is like I don't know like what is the level that I can have maximum level fifty. Regardless, let's see if I can switch the items on on me at this point for the better ones. Have some more. Or refined dueling gloves, increase damage from Barda and. Rug the dueling gloves, increased spell damage while concealed by disillusionment. That is a cool one, that's 83, that's 85. Yeah, I like to be hidden. Which sticks. We have like anything. Decreased damage taken from goblins, increased damage. With Expelliarmus. No, that was good. Those so glasses are so weird. Spectacles, I mean. Okay, this is all damage spells. Ancient Magic Throw. Okay, that's actually pretty good. I don't mind that. I look like a. I don't know. Eccentric, that's what I look. Nothing else. 70, 60 increases damage with a mandrake. I don't have any of them. And this one also increases damage with Expelliarmus as well. And the last one is regardless. It's a weird one. Okay, okay so let's get rid of the gloves. At least in the uh, silver and hexagonal spectacles. Jack o' lantern. Nothing else. This second trip to campus piece. A bunch of notes. And yeah, I have 17 mallow sweet leaves. That is a lot actually. They're only necessary for Merlin trials. Now I can get another talent. Which one should I get? When it comes to core abilities. Hmm, I can set myself, but. As for the spells, better Accio, mm -hmm. enemy strength and trans stealth, human this allows you to sprint, it also emanates an area of effect. Why not? That's for the collection. Okay, I've picked up another one. So 
is only one from the quest. Increases damage with Incendio. What else have I found? Yeah, there we go. Grab from the statue. And a Jobernal statue. I have a lot of statues of the magical creatures. Regardless. Map. Astronomy wing. All small that ends well. Speak to the half of path in the astronomy wing. Conjuration spell for the half of half in the astronomy wing seems upset about something. Perhaps I can help. Someone has scored much for. Okay, let's deal with the things that are that are close to me then. A Hufflepuff wants something. It's trackable. Hmm, what do you think that is? Let's start with Transfiguration Classroom. And go on from there. Some quest feature rewards like new spells of collection items. Consult the quest log. Oh, that is a thing I haven't actually considered. What is the reward of the quest uh, of the store? I'm gonna check in five seconds. After the game loads itself to the astronomy wing. It's actually a weird part that this but well astronomy tower. And here we are. Oh look! I haven't been here actually since the snow started falling. Who would have thought someone as young as me could save my uncle's life? Well technically you had help at Adelaide, but my family has a lineage of exemptions. Hello Adelaide. How are you and your uncle doing? Very well, thanks to you. The more I learn about Ranrock's foul lot, the more astounded I am that my uncle survived. I looked back over his old owls and noticed that they included pertinent details about his rare metal deposits. Hmm. I believe that Ranrock's fiends were after those deposits and that they needed my uncle's knowledge. He was willingly going to rot away in that cell to keep me safe. So, any more? Any other pertinent details about those owls? Plenty. Uncle Roland couldn't be certain, but he thought he overheard goblins talking about infusing something into goblin silver. Ancient he wasn't magic. sure what they meant, but something about the way they spoke of it made his skin crawl. Ugh, it's clear you saved my uncle from a very bad lot. You're welcome. It was nothing at all, Adelaide. I'm just glad your uncle's safe. So am I. Seeing him again was such a relief. I told him that he must remain vigilant from now on. Keep an eye I on him. I, for one, can't help but look over my shoulder now whenever I leave the castle grounds. Showing off is a muggle trait. You don't see that as a beckoning. Revelio. Uncle Roland sent his best. He often asks after you and his owl. He has a pen and he's an extremely famous character. Oh, would you look at that? I haven't been traversing the Hogwarts grounds that much often recently. If Hogwarts survives the reign of this headmaster, I think we should have a moon calf in charge. <laughs> well be surrounded by joy. <laughs> Nobody likes Professor Black, not even the gargoyles. I still wonder who is... Is that Professor Black that I can speak to? Shouldn't be visiting you. Uh... He thinks he's getting away with this, he has another thing coming. Evangeline? Pardon me, 
Is everything all right? No, no, it's not. We only had two bells to go, but she just had to go and spoil things. I'm afraid I don't follow who spoiled things. Was it what bells? <sighs> Professor Black ordered Mr. Moon to take down the bells in the bell tower. Said they were giving him a headache. Of course they were. are a part of Hogwarts. I wasn't about to let that happen. So, I asked my friend Adelaide to help me put them back. I just saw her. It's been a duo of sorts, Adelaide and Evangeline. Addy and Evie. And Evie. Anyway, it was going swimmingly until Black started asking questions. Then she wasn't comfortable with our rule breaking. Now I'm stuck. Unable to tell which bell goes where. Hmm. It's certainly an odd decree, even for Black, taking down the bells for a headache. I agree. I thought it might also have been that they interrupted his hourly naps. Oh, That's all he hourly. Does in the office, you know. But then I heard. Can you keep a secret? Naturally. I heard from Alice, who heard from Ollie, who heard from Eugenia. Oh because God. The bells reminded him of his wedding day. Breaks out in a sweat every hour on the hour. But mum's the word. Okay. Now you know what was his wedding. Is it really that important that the bells go back up? Is it really that important? They're part of the school's history. Those bells likely told a young Merlin that he was running late to charms, or called Ignatia Wildsmith to dinner. We can't simply fiddle with history. We're meant to be its stewards. I think you're exaggerating this thing, but fair enough. If only two bells are left, isn't it fairly easy to tell which goes where? Easy for you, perhaps. I happen to be tone deaf. Mother likes to say I couldn't carry a tune if it hopped on my back like a chocolate frog. Hmm. No point putting them back in if they don't sound just as they did before, for the sake of historical accuracy. I mean, uh, so my question is, why can't you just make a trial and error? If this doesn't sound the same way as it did before, that you put, you just switch them around. Never mind, though. I could help put the bells back up. Really? Oh, that would be wonderful. You don't seem to the thrilled. The bell tower just above the music room. No kidding. You'll certainly have more help than Adelaide. I mean, give her a break. Her uncle was kidnapped by goblins. I imagine the bells are just inside in the bell tower. Well then. Shall we go and find him? I already was there. I didn't have the spells necessary to fiddle with the bells. I mean, I did fiddle with them a bit, but... This is going to be a... a bit of a... I still wonder where is the chest that I'm being pointed to in this place? Is there in the chest somewhere? We should speak with Mr. Bickle's friends. I believe I can sneak away without drawing my mother's eye. Natty? And we will devise a plan. I forgot you were in this game. I Hold think on. I know how and where to approach the centaurs about protecting the Snidgets. Meet me in the Forbidden Forest. Sure, Alohomora. Why am I holding R2 every time I want to do Alohomora? I just I don't need that. Ah, a hippogriff. Have I been here before? What is my hippogriff? I have not. <sighs> so let's see how many more are left, but. Ah. Potion. Nothing else. There's a mirror. Was it like a passage here? Nope. That's just a small room. One chest, one statue, and some drawings of hippogriffs. <laughs> this castle is enchanted. In more ways than one. Oh, 
Revelio. Hmm? And then look at his face if you don't buy something. He's like a child with an empty pillowcase on Christmas morning. Lumos. Wow. So I still have no idea what that is. It should be somewhere in the area, I assume, but... I think it's here. Hmm, I don't think so. The headmaster hates everyone who isn't... Hmm. Am I a pure blood? Not certain. I've been here. I have been here. Yes, I have been here. I have no idea where that morph can be. Rebellion. Okay, this is the classroom. This is where it came from. Hmm. There we go. That's the Sphinx. Lose. Found it. Come with me. It's another. Hold on. Revelio. It's not so them hearing, but. Regardless. Lumos. Okay. That settled it. Let's return you back home. Broomsticks are going out of style, I think. There's so many other ways to chuck I want to play Quidditch professionally when I'm older. Good for you. What are you doing? become a professional Quidditch player. What if she's not actually that good? Are you questioning Madame Kagawa? This is a weird one. Why does she get to have the title of Madam and not, nobody goes with Madam Kagawa, not Professor Kagawa? It's like a version for a. Uh... Okay, I haven't actually. Who's that? Here perched the slimy yet symphonic frogs that composed the Hogwarts frog choir. These magical amphibians can sing in six-part harmony and hold a pitch better than most humans. Lovely. My frogs. Cute. Da. Yeah. Can't see me. What else is in here? Revelio. Does this place lead? I've been here before. Ow. Oh. Okay. I have. Mm, first I wanted there's the frogs. Revelio. It's supposed to be above the music room, but there's still something they want to check bef before I deal with this. Don't mind me. Hello, Homura. I know it's a different like some of those locks look a lot better than the rest. Like this one looks pretty good. I don't know that the textures anything that for the sort, but this one looks good. I think the previous one that they opened didn't look so good. Rebellion. What are the few gadgets or few gadgets anyway? How many are? Okay, there's another room. And there we go. 
Hold on. Let me figure this numerology one. Two plus the uh, was it grab horn? That was the name of the creature, right? So that's two, four, and I still need a six. What has six assigned to it? Nine, eight, seven, six. The uh, lizard, salamander, because of the limbs, like four legs and one tail, and a head that makes six. I don't even know. Or uh, in that actually, it does seem to have horns. So this means this thing has six horns. Perhaps three plus one plus four, and a four is a fooper. So why if four has four? It's because it has the four fed tail feathers or four head feathers. Regardless, the one, two, three, yeah, there's a fooper, is a four. Unicorn, one horn. A three headed serpent, that's three. This is a weird thing, and I think that was a five. This is a seven, still don't know idea what, what it is. Nine, what? Is that confused? Three plus one, it's four. Ah, no, a three then. So I'm sorry. I thought it was a four. My math skills suck. There we go. Brown leather gloves. Wizard mannequins. Anything else? No. There we go. Now I can play around. Ah, the bells must be upstairs. Hmm? Alohomora. Alohomora. Okay, this lock also looks pretty good. Same direction. Fair enough. There's the bell. Ah, found them. That's one. I have to get those up less. One up, one to go. I assume this one's correct. Wait, where's the other one? Oh, there it is. So, wait, what? Accio, Wingardium Leviosa. What is it upside down? Oh, it's up, up there. Well, that wasn't too hard. Evangeline should be pleased about this, even if Black isn't. Who cares for Black? I have a weird chime to them. I kind of like it. Hold on, because I think there's a chest on the other side of this door, but I need to go outside.
There it is. A Fooper statue. I'm just gonna be hearing them all day, every day. Oh, my gear slots are full. Annoying. Enter. A statue of frog ate me. Column, dark brown. Three standing clocks. Okay, this one ate me already. Is there anything else that can eat me? Nope. That is connection. Hold on, isn't there actually any way to get into this tower outside of the frog statue? Huh, apparently there isn't. Only one passage. You get you, you have to be eaten by frog. Let me just check out the vista for a little second. Can I see London from here? Probably not, because of the Scottish Highlands. God bless them. Okay, that's done. Return to Evangeline. She should be happy. I'm happy. Professor Black isn't happy. And that makes every student happy. I've done a very good thing this time. They are still ringing. What lesson am I late to? Those frogs don't sound like frogs, they sound more like birds. And when am I gonna attend music classroom? Oh, okay, fair enough, it's open now. What a beautiful winter weather we have. It's sunny. Oh look, a ghost. Not for here. This is the way. Do you know the way? Why did I make myself remember this one at this point? Ugh. I mean, I know the way, but the book knows the way. What's going on here? What's all this? I'm not going to hear it, but they seem to be speaking, but it's coming like I should be hearing them from like a floor above through the wall. Uh, there are some issues with this game still. Is that a huge problem, but it's still a problem nonetheless. Oh, my exams. <laughs> not a one of them deserves more than a T. What is a tea for? Those are annoying ones. So when did the room uh, that, the prof that the headmaster resides in change? The sheer nerve taking them down. How did order back up? The bells are back up, Evangeline. Ah, oh, you're a credit to the school. I can't wait to hear them. I can't wait for the headmaster to hear them. No, I wish I could see his face. Future generations may not truly appreciate what you've done, but I do. And I hope that you do as well. Hmm. I don't know how much this means for me and for Hogwarts. Hmm. Equipment horn. Another side in relationship quest. Okay. So now. Have I ever talked to Evangeline? She's a half a buff. 
Hmm, this is weird. Yeah, I should really do a bit of Merlin trials at this point just to get my uh, inventory to a higher number the things that I can have with me at any given time in the gear a robust wooden handle design with natural swirling wood grain what else have I actually A rampant horn. There we go. Christian clock. Wizard mannequin. Which mannequin? I thought. Which mannequin? This mannequin. Huh? Which one haven't actually noticed before yet? Oh, here we go. The Fulper statue. And another page. The frogs. And slowly but surely I'm picking up every single page. Nothing else. There's a quest though. Okay. Apparently this one doesn't give me anything, which is good, because I'm going to purchase a broom upgrade from Albi Weeks. Meet Pop in the Forbidden Forest. Speak with Natty outside of Hogsmeade. Okay, then let's go with the, this... Uh, number one, the sky's the limit. But before that, I need to return to the room of requirement and identify some items. Afterwards, back to Hogsmeade to sell some stuff. Maybe just do a couple of Merlin trials on the way. I think I'm gonna actually take the long way around, uh, about and deal with some Merlin trials because now I have every spell aside from the forbidden ones. What are you eating? Every flavored beans? I want one. In case you sound dead like there's no tomorrow, do you think like house elves don't mind any tastes? Because it is every flavored bean. Pick a flavor that you wouldn't li like to ever eat, and yeah, it's there. Only stick dueling gloves? Only had one thing to identify? Well, regardless. So let's see. If the sleek ones are better than the ones I'm currently wearing. Uh, increases damage from Expelliarmus. Decreases damage from Inferi. No, this stays. Okay, so that's dealt with. We could be dealing with a bit of my pets, but I don't want to. What else here? Oh, right. Actually, yeah, because that is... So let's start with... The summoner court. 